guys, Foxy here. Welcome to my fireplace. Nasty weather outside doesn't mean you don't have to grill. Um, we're gonna grill, we just set up some bricks and our wood holder, and we're gonna put uh, the barbecue grill topper on that, and we're gonna grow some stuffed portobello mushrooms. Now, this is a sneak peek. I'm gonna see how they come out, and if they come out good, I'm gonna share the recipe with y'all. Thanks for watching. Hi guys. So here we have our stuffed portobellos. Um, they're stuffed with uh, artichoke on the bottom, um, a handful of some vegan stuffing on the top, and then later, when they're almost done, we're gonna put some of our favorite smoked Gouda, vegan of course, on top. So we're gonna put these on the grill. Oh, smells so good. <laughs> hey, dude. Mom. What? Look. <laughs> <laughs> Yum. Okay. How pretty does that look? Is it cool? Yeah. Happy. <laughs> you smell it. Hi, guys. Um, while the portobello are on the grill, I just wanted to mention real quick that with the broken ends and pieces and the stems, I just cut them up real quick and uh, cut up some real sweet Texas onion and put the rest of the marinade that I marinated the portobello's in in here. So we'll have this as like a little side dish. It's super sweet, super good when that stuff gets caramelized and it smells like barbecue just in this kitchen. Hi guys. <laughs> My camera girl is being silly, so pardon the shakiness. Anyway, we're back at the portobello's and I just wanted to share a quick tip with you. Um, you might want to wonder why I decided to grill when it's nasty outside. I stop at my local grocery store every two or three days and pop into um, the vegetable section, of course, because that's where we do the main part of our shopping, and always snag up whatever they have half off. Um, and of course, if it's half off, that means it's due to be sold in a day or two, and you need to use it right away. Well, they happen to have these bad boys half off today, and I bought like nine packages. So I think I spent like $1.25 each one. I still have a couple packages left. And uh, like I said, you work with what you got. So why not? Portobello mushrooms, they're usually expensive. They're freaking fantastic. And so here we go. So there's your tip. Shop your local grocery store. Find out when they put their stuff half off and go grab it. It's a great way to save uh, money. And so you have more money to buy fun things like blenders. Hint, hint. <laughs> okay guys, we're back. Uh, we just sprinkled a little bit of cheese on the mushrooms after we took them off the grill and we threw them in the oven for about five minutes just to finish them off. And then we put those uh, onions and mushrooms on the side that were marinated. So if you would like to see the full recipe, um, go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and uh, leave me a comment below. I haven't gotten a whole lot of comments yet. I'd love to receive one. Let me get one from you. See you later.